NASA engineers shipped a major component of the Artemis II mission today. It was made right here in the Rocket City, and that mission will be the first to fly around the moon in almost 50 years. We sent Wave 51 reporter Jillian Kay to the arsenal for this historic moment. When you take a look at the Saturn V rocket outside the Space and Rocket Center, you'll see the part where it kind of starts to take a cone shape here. Well, I'm told that part of a NASA rocket is called the Launch Vehicle Stage Adapter. I'll get more into what that means in just a moment, but today I had the chance to watch a major part of the Artemis II mission go from Huntsville to Florida. Here's a look at that key adapter now. It took about four years to make. Experts say it's the biggest piece of hardware coming out of Huntsville that will be used in the Artemis II mission around the moon. I'm told this piece is essential for a successful mission connects to the main piece. So the main piece gets you out of Earth's orbit. This piece says, okay, wait a minute, there's a second stage that we've got to be able to get people to the moon. So this is a piece which allows those two to connect together and say, oh, this is how you can make this happen. Crews loaded the Huntsville made part onto the Pegasus barge. It will sail down the Tennessee River, pick up other parts along the way, and eventually end up at Kennedy Space Flight Center in Florida next week. The Artemis II mission manager tells me they plan to take off in September 2025. He says about a year out from the launch, they will begin some serious astronaut training. I'm in Huntsville with coverage you can count on. Jillian Kay, Way 31 News.